Thank you so much for joining us for another video. This is Arlene Sings. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And if you're new to our channel, thank you so much for joining us. And again, welcome you to my channel. My name is Arlene, my wife, beautiful wife, Annie. And tell us, Annie, what you did for us today. Um, well, we just had a Q&A planned for tonight, so I thought we'd have some noshing. Uh, my little wine right here, some goat cheese, some jam. Some crackers. Well, these are lavash with sesame. It's really good. I like these. And also some Hawaiian um, rolls and yeah, some salami, some cucumbers. Mm -mm, I'm ready to dig in, baby. So, Thank you so much. Mm, so why don't you get started on some crackers and I'll pull up my questions and we'll get okay, started. Can I start with this? Help yourself to whatever you okay. like. So, whatever flows. Try to do this with a spilling. Make sure you get some jam too. Like that song, Jam. That's the sound of music. Oh, I was thinking of Guy. Jam. Yeah. <laughs> I guess I should have seen. Okay. Okay, so I'm going to get my. Yeah, I'm not doing good here, baby. So you need help? Yes, please. You know, I, I can't do this stuff. I need you, I need you yeah. like I need air. I keep on pushing and I keep some, you know what we forgot is little plates, but we don't need them, right? No? Okay. There you go. You got napkins yeah, right there. Salami. Pretend we're at a park. Ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo. And we're sitting on the grass. What are you going to have? Are you going to have just what you're going to have? Well, I don't care if I'm going to get messed in the park. I'm sorry, but I'll pick it up afterwards. But I don't need Mm. Mm. Yeah. Mm. I need to go. Okay, guys. <laughs> 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 I just got it. Mm. Mm. Yeah. That is so good, baby. Mm -hmm. But the only sell at the store is little ones. Oh, cheese. Well, at the store we went to Trader Joe's, they sell a nice roll of it. Mm. With um, a nice roll for just two ninety nine. What Trader Joe? Mm hmm. Well, we need to go to Trader Joe, baby. You know what I'm saying? I can do this. Okay, you got it now. Yeah. Yeah, because you top me, mm -hmm. punk. Nothing fancy, just. Man, I've been dying to have this. Up. I've been dying mm -hmm. to have goat cheese. Cause, mm -hmm. like I said, the one time I went to her cousin's. Mm -hmm. And they have goat cheese, and that's when I got so full I can even eat the part. Mm. Okay. Mm. Mm. The meal itself, man. Mm -hmm. <laughs> With jam. Mm. Mm. This is so good, guys. If you haven't tried it, you must. Okay. Mm. Question Maybe. Sleep in or rise early? Sleeping. Well, actually, lately I've been rising early because I feel like most of the day is gone already. Mm hmm. She usually is sleeping, beauty. Mm -hmm. But lately, but no, for a while now, you're you know, you sleep in only when you're really tired, but you do get up early now. Mm. Can you? Huh? I'm sorry, I'm sorry. It's a little loud. Yeah, it's a little loud. Ah. Well, because mm. the weekend. Okay. Mm -hmm. so fast otherwise. I hate Before, I we'd say yes, you were the sleepy head. Mm -hmm. But no. For a while, she's been getting up early now. Um, Kiss or hug? I love to kiss, but I'm a hugger. Mm -hmm. But I love to kiss. I love to kiss. Mm -hmm. If it's for her kiss, mm -hmm. if it's for anybody else, I like to hug her. Mm -hmm. She is a kisser. I mean, a hugger. <laughs> and she is a kisser. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yes. Um, yes. Yes. Ocean or lake? Lake. Well, I love the lotion, but 
with all this stuff going on, I would rather be in a lake. Um, I, used to be I say lake also. I used to be ocean, but I'm lake. With my dad, I used to swim out to the buoys, but I would not do that now. Mm-mm. Okay, Mm-mm. winter or summer? Winter all the way, baby. <laughs> what about you? You asked me about this question, but you don't answer me. Okay, well, here you can take it over. Because I want to dig into. Yeah, winter or summer? Winter. Well, I do enjoy summer, but like enough is enough, you know? So, uh, winter. It's winter. funny. And people oh, who winter. have extended winters probably wish they had more summer, but when you're just on summer. All the time. All the time. Yeah, I would like some winter. I want to wear some cute. You know, jackets, some cute boots, some yeah, cute we sweaters. Can't, we can't even wear that much. Mm-hmm. I should go to North Carolina. So. Okay, so family or friends? I know this one. What? Family? Really? Always. Yes. Yeah, that's what I thought. I knew it! <laughs> okay, so. Is there a silly accomplishment you made that you're secretly proud of? Is there a silly accomplishment you've made that you're secretly proud of? Mm-hmm. Yeah, maybe now that all this vaping stuff is coming out, um, you don't maybe do it, no it doesn't sound so silly. Yeah, it sounds kind of smart now, but I was vaping for a while. Oh my God, she doesn't even smoke. She was vaping. I don't. I don't smoke cigarettes, and I was like this all the time. Every time you saw, I used to make fun of her. Like, Arnie, don't smoke, but like, <laughs> Arnie, don't smoke. But she'd be making me yeah. like crazy. Mm-hmm. And I go, man, they but, smoke. So that tells you I understand, and it is possible. So, mm-hmm. you know what? I'm glad that I I did it mm-hmm. for a couple years, but mm-hmm. I'm glad I don't do that anymore. And now oh, you see these people ending up in the hospital. Oh, Remember, yeah. I got bronchitis a couple times. Yeah, with that. she did. Mm-hmm. She got bad bronchitis. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I can never smoke vape. So it hurt my lung. Mm-hmm. Smoking the, but vaping. Oh my God, it will hurt. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So, oops. So yeah, I'll, I'll take that one. Hmm. Okay, I'm gonna have a question for you. Mm-hmm. Where's your movie favorite movie star? Oh, I don't know. You know I don't watch that many movies. I got a few. Yeah, you do. But that, it's not because I was raised Italian. I just love him. Like Al Pacino, Robert De Niro. Well, yes, those are great actors. John Travolta, Sylvester Stallone. Those mm-hmm. are all my favorites. Anytime I watch him, I see a movie about them, I've got to watch it. Mm-hmm. Huh. Mm-hmm. Okay, there's a movie down there. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so mm-hmm. you have to have one. It would be probably whatever yours are. Mm. What is your favorite book? The Four Agreement. You know which one mine is? By Don Rui. Don. The Four Agreements? That's the one you showed me, right? Is that one book that you showed me with Four Agreements? You always went by that? Mm hmm. Don Miguel Ruiz. Miguel Ruiz? Mm hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, I didn't know that it was the name of this Miguel Ruiz. I'm no Spanish person, though. Mm-hmm. Oh, damn, two years old, so been a long time. It's, um, he's teaching ancient Toltec knowledge and teaching. It's really oh, good. wow. Mm-hmm. That's cool, man. Well, mine, I don't know how to say it in Spanish, in English, but mine is Mi Tanta de Arancalima. I was a kid when I read that, and I couldn't, I don't like to read, I fall asleep. That's the problem that I have. I'm more visual. But for some reason, my mom gave me that book. I couldn't stop reading. I read the whole book. It wasn't a big book, but it was like a kid's book. Mm-hmm. And I read it on one night. Mm-hmm. That's all I knew. That one and Anne, that lady, that Jewish girl. Also oh, The Diary one. of Anne Frank. That also I read that whole book. In I also like Nicholas Sparks books. No? Nicholas Sparks. Hmm. He's an author. See, I'm so bad with names. I don't remember any of the people with these books, but... If I like the book, this the book I was trying to remember. 
-huh. Mi planta naranja en Lima es a plant uh -huh. of lime orange. Okay. Yeah. So that was a good book. Mm. Okay, whoever he asks some of these questions, why are we? When you were a kid, did you think any dream career choice was out of your reach? And if you did, what is it? Oh, yeah, because I've always been short and I always love modeling and stuff. <laughs> And I always said it'd be so cool just to like, you know, runway walk, all these beautiful fashions. Yeah, and she has good taste, so she would have been, you would have been great, baby. I never had a chance. <laughs> you can't do that at my height. They, well, they have other kind of modeling. doesn't have to be that kind of modeling. They have all kinds of modeling. I was a kid. It's not something I would do now. You know, I don't like to flaunt. I don't, um, you know. You, we're talking about kid, right? When I was a kid. Yeah. But I grew up into a totally different person. Yes, we do. Well, I have a good question for you because I don't think I know this one. Hmm. What do you see yourself doing after retirement? I think I know one of them. Okay, I'm curious what you think, you know. Travel. Um, yes. Because you always talk about traveling. Mm -hmm. And I want to read more and I want to... Um, you know, uh, do like yoga. I want to take time to meditate. Do you have time for that kind of stuff in retirement? I would love to, uh, yeah, exercise in our peace and stuff like that. I know it sounds like cheesy, but, you know, I struggle with meditation. I struggle with quieting my mind. And, you know, if you're in retirement, why not focus the energy like, nope. Sit your butt down, and you're going to do it, and you're going to do it until you do it. <laughs> so, um, I don't know. What about you? And travel, but of course, travel. Um, we have to find our retirement state. Mm -hmm. Any suggestions, anybody? I've been asking, but I, I know. haven't heard anything. So I know, but I we just have to keep asking for new leads, because by the time we're ready to be traveling and stuff, that's where we'll start. We can have the jam. I just want another one. I'm kind of good with the cucumbers. I don't know. What I'm, I'm still just picking. So, um, um, what do you? No, well, what about you? I would like to go back to Argentina just to visit. Mm hmm. And I would like to go to Florence because my mother would got a chance to go for her. I'm willing to go to Florence. Argentina is, um, that's, that's a heck of a travel. The only thing that we have to be. be in, in, I know. In I'm a little bit nervous. I went there once, and it's pretty intense. Yeah. Um. So you know, we'll talk about that. Yeah, and these are our fun questions. That's yeah. It's our fantasy. You've been there. We've been there. We've been there separate, but it's pretty intense. But it's very beautiful and stuff. But my thing is, I would like to see somebody with their life when I go. Because you know. Uh, people get over you. So, do you hold grudges or forgive it to me? <laughs> what? Is, is that a real question or is that just you? Do you hold grudges oh, okay. or forgive it to me? I'm not making this up. Um, okay. Like with you or people or what? Okay, or just my know. heart, period. Um, before I've always held grudges. Yeah. Mm hmm She did. I'm wired that way. Wait, but she oh, taught me so much, yes, in thirteen years. She taught me so much. Mm -hmm. And I it's not even worth it. We we argue, we do, we get on each other's nerves. All the time. But um more times than not, before it even gets there, when we're getting on each other's nerves, we just go yeah. Okay. <laughs> or at least I don't. Just we go, take off. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> and I just. <laughs> okay. Well, I'm glad she hasn't cold grudges anymore. Yeah. Oh, no. But I can. She can. <clears throat> but she's gotten so much better. But yes. She has a beautiful heart. It's know? not worth <clears throat> it. It's such a waste of time. It is a waste of energy. You. Yeah. My young self was oh, so prideful and very grudgeful, but can't tell you anything 
positive that it accomplished. No. I'm older now. That takes way too much energy, and I'd rather just be happy mm-hmm. and be about. Life is too short. Yeah, it's too short to keep grudges. You know, just move on. Don't look at the person anymore. Um, <laughs> how do you feel about crowds of people? You know how I feel about crowds. I know, but this is a question that I'm asking. Mm. It's on the questionnaire. Don't like crowds of people. Yes. And if there's a crowd of people, that's cool. But I need my space. Give me my space. I like personal space. I know I'm not the only one. Yes, what about you? Yes. Um, I used to be all about crowds and people. Now when I'm getting older, I hate it. I mean, it depends where I'm at. I'm not personal space. I'm, I'm, not, I'm not into crowds anymore. I mean, life has changed since before. So mm-hmm. I, I, I just rather be in a small group than have a thousand people there. Yeah. Although the Hollywood Bowl is a beautiful yes, venue it is. and oh we had well, such a great time. The music and stuff yeah, was awesome. we had such a great time at the Playboy Jazz Festival. And people were so nice. Of Everybody course. was having a great time. Good music, good mm-hmm. vibes. I mean that's what it was all about. They were passing alcohol. Mm-hmm. <laughs> people sharing is caring. Yeah, they were you can take your own alcohol. Okay, this is a long one, but it's, I think it's gonna be the last for me. It's a last. If you had to wear one outfit from head to toe every day for a year, what would it be? You could have more than one of each item so you could wash them and they wouldn't wear out before the year was done. But you have to look the same every day. Mm, it would be like a Jackie O outfit. A Jackie O outfit? Or like a Madame Maisel outfit. You know, beautiful dress, little shirt jacket, you know, some like maybe low heels, Mary Jane. Cute hat or something with like a flower or a bow, hmm. but yeah, I would be super femmed out. I would like to wear. I like to dress nice, but mm-hmm. you know when I'm comfortable. Shorts, oh, she loves her comfy clothes. Short shirts. I mean, comfy. You know, tennis. I shoes. know what your favorite outfit would be. <laughs> I usually have my home uniform. Yeah. When I get home, I put my shorts on, a shirt, whatever, you know. And yeah, we all do, but everybody has that. But if she could live in it, she would. I would, every day. Yeah, or my she, hat, every day. Every, every, every day. Every day. I'm kind of full. <laughs> Me too. That was good fun. Anyway, guys, good it snacking. Was fun. Like, we just wanted to share this. Good I can't believe we got goat cheese. I was thinking about yes, goat that, cheese. that was her excitement of this the day. This is so goat good. Cheese. It's really good. It's kind of um, I love sweet. It. I love it. Love it. Love it. And not into the goat. Other than my sign, <laughs> she's a goat. And we're having goat. goat cheese. <laughs> other than my, other than my sign, uh, I'm a goat. I'm stubborn. I'm all that. I'm but anyways, goat. but uh, but goat cheese. I never. Mm, I like I'm not that into birria. Well, I like this goat cheese. But yes, yeah, so yeah, my cousin turned us on to yeah, this, she and turned oh, on. and you know she's so lactose intolerant, but it's, it's great. Easier on her, so yeah, we're enjoying it. We are. I'm glad she's enjoying it. And I'm full of the full, and this is great. Mm-hmm. So, so, so anyway, guys, thank you so much again for joining us. Hope you enjoyed our little snack dinner. Our spread. Our mm-hmm. spread. I uh, hope you either have breakfast, lunch, dinner with us. And again, <laughs> um, yes, yeah, snack time because mm-hmm. I'm full. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, guys, so if you like our video, please give it a thumbs up. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And also, the last thing I always ask, please, please, please make sure you ring, ring, ring the bell, ring the bell, and send it out to all. <laughs> that way you don't miss any of our uploads. Don't want to miss it. Or live TV. <laughs> uh, anyway, guys, thank you so much for joining us. Until next time. Peace.